Hello everyone, welcome to my first ever Kerbal uh, Let's Play. Well, I've had Kerbal for about... Uh, pretty much ever since it came on Steam. And I haven't done any videos with it. Well, I thought it was time to change that. Let's play a career game. And you see how you can see how I do things. Lovely music in the background. Yeah. So, basically, let's go to the job center, as it were. No, that's the the uh, space plane. Nowhere near good enough to try that yet. Oh, right. Ah. Launch a new vessel. Vessel. Yes. Reach 5,000. Yes. Yes. These are all things that are easy to do and they never go away. So... <laughs> the first thing I always do, this is the simplest and stupidest craft there is. This is just to launch a craft. <laughs> Okay, let's put that there. Full throttle, might as well. Let's see if I can get high. Whee! See how far a single tank should get us. And it should, hopefully, unless I'm mistaken, get us near that 5,000. Yup. <laughs> Can't quite believe it, can he? Right, let's go. Crew report. Uh, shores look inviting. And you watch the waves roll into the coast. Okay, keep data. Parachute time. Pretty much going to land straight back on the dam. Uh... Hang on, let me just check. You should keep that uh, ludicrous. So I can just speed this down. <laughs> dee 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 dee. And I should be getting. Well, let's see. I've got a uh, reward of 2,293.58 and 10.9. Uh, reputation that was for getting it up that high and I got five science for launching a new vessel and 4,587.16 cash and 10.9 no reputation and this was a cheap mission a very cheap mission this was the definition of a cheap mission because it basically takes out two of our main objectives and opens up the rest of the uh, pack, as it were. So. Let's take those off. Now let's slow it down when we get closer to the ground. There used to be a bug in Kerbal where if you didn't slow the time down, it would go down like a rocket and actually destroy the ship. It was quite funny. <laughs> but quite annoying as well, so... Yeah, you always lose the engine, which is a bit of a shame, but... EVA <laughs> EVA report This <laughs> is a precarious situation, keep data. Hang on, let's uh EVA him again. Ooh. 
Well, actually, EBA report. I don't think we needed it. Yeah. Uh, take surface sample. This surface is charred and coated with burnt rocket propellant. Uh, also, trace amounts of. <laughs> oh, that's quite funny. Uh, let's recover. Yep, surface sample from North Pad. Oh, and also I need to uh, go into the space center because there's a thing that recover the vessel. Here we go, space parts, fuel tank, command pod, fuel pump, liquid fuel. There's actually some liquid fuel. What? This mono propellant. There always is some mono propellant. I never know why. There is some mono propellant left, but there always is. So, here we go. Okay. Uh, solid fuel rocket booster stack decoupler. Ugh. I hate doing these. These are annoying. Okay, let's mm -hmm. do the... Uh... Parachute. That one's quite easy to do. Uh, set altitude, yeah, well that never expires, so you might as well take that as well. Uh, give yourself extra stuff. Research 5, and don't do any more. Yes, I do. Right. One, two, three. And those fuel tanks. And there. I know this might seem like a strange thing to do. <coughs> <coughs> Pardon me. <coughs> but. There is method to my madness. Honest. Honest there is. Um, go away. Uh, yes. Let's go one and then let's have that one separate stage. Let's see if we can do this. It's a cheap vessel that should be able to take on what we need it to do. Okay. So what's the task? Flying altitude... Oh my good god. Test the Mark 16 parachute. The Mark 16 parachute. Right, there you are. Uh, altitude 10,000, speed 62, 36,000, oh dear. Okay, I'll see if I can do it with this. I'm not sure. Let's get up to... Let's get up to 100 kph. Oh, Meters, 100 meters per second, so we'll get in there. Jeez. Oh. That's not quite what I was after. Oh well. <laughs> I don't think I've done this right. Because, yeah, I just overshot the speed and then I'm going to get to the correct height. Yeah, I... 
Oh, I've got a new altitude record. Oh, well, that's good. Oh, dear. I'm also over water. That's a bad thing. With Kerbal, if you can land all parts of the actual spacecraft, you... Oh, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait a minute. The speed is right, but the altitude's wrong. Ugh. If I can... If the altitude... If the speed and the altitude stay the... Right, no. If the speed keeps it the same within the set markings, which I think it is, it's... I've just got to get to the right altitude, and I am dropping like a stone. I might as well take scientific readings, even though I'm not anywhere near the ground anywhere near the uh... come on come on don't don't go over don't go over 360 don't go over 360 don't go over 360 because I need you to bollocks went over to 360 speeds too quick bugger and now we get the correct altitude. Ugh. Just my smegging luck. Oh well. Uh, okay. Well, now we get the correct altitude. Speed. Now we don't have the correct altitude. Ugh. Oh, that's so annoying. It's just. Ugh. Yeah, the design works well, but I think I need to sort of get a 50% on the throttle so that I can get enough pr uh, movement before I get to the correct stage, if you see what I mean. But at least I got reach uh, 11,000 meters in the sky. At least I've reached that, which is not a bad thing. Unfortunately, I'm going to lose... Two FT, uh, FLT 200 fuel tanks. And three FLT 400 fuel tanks. And a couple of rocket motors. And some girders. That's going to be annoying. Let's speed this up. I'm getting bored. Yeah, unfortunately, when it hits the water... Uh, oh! He did survive! I thought he didn't! Oh well, uh, take data. Uh, hang on. EVA report. Uh, I don't think the spaceship was intelligent necessary to get where it was, was it? No, it wasn't. Take surface sample. We've taken a sample of water. It appears to dramatically increase the surface humidity of anything it touches. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> uh, grab. Grab. Oh well, I'll have to retrieve you in two pieces. But EBA report, and I got 44 science for that. Well, I got 18.7 science, which is good. And the crew, Jebediah Kerman, is back, so that's quite good. Let's get the spacecraft which has a cover vessel, command pods, parachute and monopropellant. Yeah, also there's three bits of junk, so I might as well cover that. What, I don't get... Oh, that's mean! Where... 
What? Where's these three bits of debris? I've already got them. Oh well. Okay, back out to that. Uh, let's try something. Nice idea with the rockets. I think I just need more fuel. Uh, that's not going to work. this there we go let's put let's put the science thing on there anyway let's not have three of them it's not worth it just one of them will do and let's see if I can get it so that you're going at the right speed and at the right altitude so okay first things first booster motors first standard rocket engine next let's get the oh yeah I'm just gonna shoot past the speed requirement aren't I Hopefully I can... Okay, let's... Make sure it slows... Ooh! Okay... Yes! Right, stop the engines! Okay, do the science! Observe whatever the hell that is, the goo jiggling and wobbles as the craft flies. Um, crew report. Oh, unfortunately I can't learn anything from this, keep data. Okay, now here's the tricky part. I'm over the water a little and I don't want to be. That's the problem I face. Now, if I'm clever enough and I've got like 1% pull it in this direction a little come on Maybe I can risk 2% can I risk 2% come on come on Yeah, so I think I'm over water. So I can save my propellant. I cannot save the engine. So shut down engine. I think that might help. Might save it, I don't know, but let's speed this up, shall we? Oh, I think I want to put that. Oh dear. Am I over the water or aren't I? Activate the engine. Come on, I want to be over land, not water. Water costs me far too much. Also, this decreases the descent rate. It's a neat trick, especially if you've got a lot of fuel left. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, how the... Come on, I have got to get into that dry spot. It's only X big, but... That's better. I think... Uh, yes, I'm in the... No, I'm... I don't know. 
I can't tell from... This spot, it's too difficult to tell. Um, okay, so... Oh shit, I'm in the watery spot. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Try, 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 try. Do not go into the water. Go into the... Go onto the sand. Go onto the sand. Yes! Okay, I only lost one thing, and yeah, I'm recovering that. That was a good recovery, and I know I could have picked up a sand thing, but... So, mysterious crew, crew report, yes! Got a lot of fuel back, got a lot of command pod, parachute, mystery goo, girder segment, monopropellant, liquid fuel oxidized some solid fuel, well, it didn't really give me anything, and the crew member, yay, Jebediah coming. So, uh, what do we want to do next? Radial mount parachute, but I wonder. <coughs> yes! When it set altitude, that never expires. Uh, side fuel rocket piston flight of a cable. No, 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 radial mount parachute. No, flight of a cable. That's not too difficult <laughs> either. So, uh, let's see. Shall I? So I've got. I've got enough to get that. But I'm not going to get it. Because it's given to me free. So... Why bother? Here we go. There we go. One radial mount parachute. Now... What's the criteria? Flying it... Flight. Sunny. Oh, shit, this one. God, I played this one. I tried to get this one a few times. I think I need more fuel in the middle s section. Like so. Okay. Ah! Okay. I know this seems strange. But, this should also help with these. Uh, so I want that. I want that one on a separate uh, setup. So which one's that? That one's that one. That's that one. So that one goes first. The rest of them go later. <laughs> now, once we finish this, doing this? I'm not touching the controls, what the hell? Come on, 18,000, 18,000. That's not too difficult for this engine. Oh, great, but I've got to make sure the speed's right. Ugh. Wait a minute, wait a minute. 
Yes! Stop all engines. Right. Scientific breakthrough. Go on. What is it? That'll do. <laughs> oh dear God. Well, at least I'm uh, not over... Um, wait a minute. At least I'm not over water. Over water costs me money. I don't like it when it costs me money. Uh-oh. Uh. Hang on. Let's change that altitude to max. Maximum altitude. Maximum altitude. And maximum altitude. So basically, it lands. All it needs to do right now. This is a test bed for everything that the Kerbals want to test. It's nothing more than a big, giant set of test beds. <laughs> Wait a minute. What? Wait a minute. What? Is that still operating at that slow ass. Uh, hang on. What are you operating at? Oh. There you go. All of the parachutes are out. <laughs> uh, speed this up a bit. Got 5,000 meters to go. Don't want to bore my fans to death. <sighs> I'm going to go and get a coffee. What are you, what? Do any of you guys want anything? No, Jennifer Lawrence. I don't know Jennifer Lawrence's phone number or anything else. If I had Jennifer Lawrence's phone number, do you think I'd give it to you? I'd be using it. Let's be serious, people. Let's be serious. So, we got contract... This is the radial parachute, and I got four science, four point is science, ninety four, super awesome, yay, and some money. Uh, completion reward of uh, some money and some yay, and some more completion reward of some money and some yay. You're awesome. <laughs> Right. Yeah, take that off, take that off. Oh, for God's sakes, this is slow. Where's the monopropellant? Let's turn off the engine. Having one... <laughs> Having three, five, three, yeah, five parachutes to travel this down is taking a long bloody time. Jesus. But okay, I, okay, uh, only losing one, uh, RT1 solid fuel rocket booster isn't a bad thing. And I've at least got all the science and shit, so... Yeah, Mysterious Girl... Uh, super upper atmosphere. Aero vessel from Flight of Kerbin. Yeah. Uh, parts. Got a lot of nice parts and crew. So... I've got enough to do research for survivability, definitely. So let's go for that. Uh, what? What else do these guys want? Radial decoupler. 
Uh -huh. uh, cycle rocket booster. Ugh. Uh, step decoupler, test separation pipe over curbing. Well, you'll see what happens next in the next part of the playthrough. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you like it, or just watch another episode until you want to subscribe.